Eric. I was just about to pop round. After your, uh, your little workout. <laughs> yeah, that's right. So you weren't about to uh, make a run for it? Or were the police due to put the handcuffs on me any minute? I haven't spoken to the police as yet. Well, you seemed pretty keen to grasp me up yesterday. Whether I take this matter further depends entirely upon you and the conversation that we're about to have right now. Your sister has asked me to reconsider my decision in reporting you to the police. That's weird, considering she hates me almost as much as everyone else does. Uh, actually, she loves you. For some inexplicable reason. <laughs> she said if she loses you, she'd be very unhappy. Well, she should have thought about that all those years ago when she dumped me as a kid. Oh, I see. So all this is her <laughs> fault, is it? I screwed up. I've let her down and I've let myself down. You know, I always... I always thought I'd make something of myself. Be a... a someone. A name. Like, drive a, a fast car. Or own a big house. But the other day when I, I saw you lying there, this poor man struggling for breath because of what I did, I realised I wasn't the hard man I thought I was. I was just some petty criminal who stole from pensioners. I hated myself. But I did call an ambulance and save your life, no matter what it cost me. And if that doesn't show you that there is some good in here, then Everyone deserves a second chance, Eric. So please, let me make this right. When I was lying there on the ground, dying, I suppose, you know what went through my mind? Not money, possessions, anything like that. Just a terrible sadness. They're all the people that I love I would never, ever see again. The only way to gauge a well-lived life is by how much love is in it. How much can you say is in yours, Mackenzie? None. Not right now. Don't get the police involved. Get them off Aaron's back, he doesn't deserve this. And I swear to you, I'll be a better person. Promise to build bridges with the family. Prove yourself that you are the decent human being that refused to let me die. And, um, if I could have Valerie's coat back, I won't press charges. I'll make sure Aaron is in the clear. I promise. Hand and heart. Renee, on your promise, and I'll make sure you go to prison, whatever it takes. <laughs> 